first is you won't change, pick a start point. Any place that you can succeed, that you know will succeed, small success is okay, small one. You say I want 5% increase in the uh, number of students over 80% in this semester. 2% increase. Get that 2% and say fantastic, we got 2, let's do now 2.5 over the next semester. Before you realize it, your entire college's LCM would have crossed that benchmark which you had set for yourself, which is part of your vision. So that is what you do, pick a start point. Thereafter, when you want change, involve people in the conversation. Let people believe that they are stakeholders in the change process. Establish a reason, explain to me. Talk to me and tell me why change is important and I will then participate in the change process. Many times, say it once, say it twice, conference, workshop, morning prayer, emails, circulatory notes, put it on a notice board, put it on the college cafeteria, say it around in your dance ballet, say it around your annual days, your functions, your club days, your outing excursions. Repeat it, people will start believing it. Each of the members in your institution are all change agents and leaders. Treat them like that, change will happen. Create an acceptance. The fact is that without change, progress is not possible. Once people start accepting it, change will get accepted. Look for people who are resistors. There will always be people who resist. You need to work very hard on resistors. And last but not the least, please don't believe that there is only one way to make this change happen. There are always a hundred ways. They say there are many ways to skin a cat.